Hey, hello everyone, thanks for watching and I'm back here with a new video Yeah, today I um, didn't even plan to make a video um, But yesterday we had actually a very good day Let's take a look on CoinMarketCap If you look over here Well, actually If you... Um, if you look a bit better yeah we were just uh, going on an up trend um, yesterday when you looked on uh, Binance almost everything was in green literally everything everything all my coins were in green so this was yesterday Saturday and today 7th uh, uh, Sunday 4th of February almost everything is in the red again very good coins Power Ledger, VeChain, Cardano, Stellar Lumens, Wabi for under 180 that's just crazy so yeah there is um, again a lot of uh, redness on, on the market and i want to make this video because yeah today when i w woke up yeah i just i just like it when uh when other youtubers give their opinion in these uh, um, volatile strange um, um times you know um Box mining does a very good job giving us daily updates. I really like it. Mr. Crypto, it's a Dutch YouTuber, really like him also. Um, Altcoin Buzz, they gave an update, but definitely not what I wanted to hear. I'm not a fan of Altcoin Buzz, to be honest. Um, but they do have some good picks. Yeah, almost all the channels have good picks. Um, but I watched the, uh, yeah the video that I, they uploaded today. Yeah, it was very. Uh, I didn't I didn't get what I wanted to hear, you know. And uh, when I'm I'm a bit um, sad about this whole market, I always watch decentralized TV. This vibe of this guy just gives me the energy energy to go on. Even in my first, um, even in my first week of uh, cryptocurrency, a lot of YouTubers made made me a bit uh, insecure. Uh, they talk like they know everything, and uh, that it is a uh, yeah. They they just made me insecure. And this guy explains things just in a good way. It's a very intelligent guy, also. Has a Lambo in his garage, but that need to say more, you know. <laughs> Box mining again. Look at uh, this. You need definitely check out this uh, presentation about blockchain revolution. But yeah, I just didn't get what I want to hear. So yeah, back to the story. I need to make my own video. Uh, uh, yesterday everything was in green. Today a lot uh, is in the red. Um, let's take a quick. I mean, you can just see a lot of redness on the market, you know, I mean, yesterday a lot of people uh, were very happy, me also, I uh, posted uh, something on uh, social media, uh, something like good morning with, uh, with um, you know, um, crypto mobs and you, you saw everything was in green, but... Um, yeah, it's actually logical. I mean, when you uh, are not logical, let me let me explain this. Good. When you see one uh, day of green numbers, yeah, that doesn't mean that this whole downtrend is ending. Uh, in my opinion, from what I've heard, um, we we will go up again when we hit bottom, and it seems like we didn't hit bottom yet. Uh, I made a purchase of Bitcoin on 9,400. I made another purchase on 8,400 because I thought that was maybe a bit of the bottom. But I think, I'm not sure, 
I my prediction was it wouldn't go or under a thousand, and you see it hovers. It hovers, it really hovers about uh, around this eight thousand. So not to brag, but I think I made a good prediction. But it could be because, yeah, the media really pulls out everything. I I won't go uh, uh, pronounce all the facts because I just don't know them. But uh, if you look at um, uh, Box Mining, his channel, he 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 mentioned all the things that are happening. And um, you have India fought, you have Tether fought, you have you know, still have the Bitconnect fought, and um, a, a lot of stuff happening. And it's very strange because there's actually very good news. Bitcoin Lightning Network that will be revolutionary in the Bitcoin uh, system. They they are making good progress, and uh, the, the 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 news about this uh, Lightning Network. Most people don't even know what it is. They don't even care. They just want to make quick money. But there's a lot of good stuff happening. There's another stuff about Robinhood. is an uh, is an, uh, a stock market app, a bit focused on the younger people, and they are going to implement clip cryptocurrencies. I think it would be start from this month, end of this month. I don't know that exactly. Do your own research about that. But very good news. I think, to be honest. Um, this is my personal uh, opinion. I think the media, uh, the people are pulling out everything that they have um, to spread the FUD. You know, they are people are still uh, a bit uncertain. I, I am very, I'm very convinced of, about this stuff. It, nobody needs to convince me. But when I after after uh, these days when I uh, when I went to social media or I checked on social media the messages, indeed I saw some people freaking out. My my favorite YouTuber definitely Cryptos or us. I went to his Twitter and I literally saw an idiot mention, "Yeah, you thought Ethereum was a better store of value than Bitcoin, and now Ethereum is dropping." He, he made a good pick. Ethereum is next to Bitcoin, a, a very good coin uh, to put your, uh, uh, to, 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 yeah, to, to, to put a lot of your, uh, uh, to, to keep it as a safe haven, you know? And you need to do your own research and people are just freaking out. And I think today, nowadays, it's very easy to get information. We go here, press something in and we see it. We go to Google and we see it. But I think what is happening is people think they know it. Because when you Google something and you see one uh, uh, one sentence and you think, oh, they have my answer. A lot of the times the story behind it, the real story, the whole story is a bit more complicated. It's, it is with everything like that. Even I'm, I'm personally a grower. I can tell you a lot of stuff, the basics, and it is very simple. But when you want to grow top quality wheat, it gets a bit more complicated. I need to tell you more stuff. And that's the same with crypto. And people are freaking out. And what I wanted to explain is because of all this FUD, the media was spreading. You can just see it because at this point, till here, this period, the media was giving of Here it was all positive. The media was like, Oh, what the hell is this? What, what, uh, what is this new stuff? Can you explain? Like there were fucking idiots. Remember, they have the most smart people working for them, and they go on TV acting like they're fucking idiots. No, it's not like that. Remember, they are playing both sides. They are smart people. Don't don't forget that they are very smart people. We are here. Behind our desktops, doing our research, you think those people that have millions of dollars within the company can't hire people that do their research for them? So I think back to the point. I think um, um, here they give it good attention, positive attention. Here they started the fud. Yeah, is it is it good? People are losing money. Mining costs a lot of money. It's wrong information about hacks, this and that. And here they put in hard. A lot of people were spreading a lot of thought about yeah what I just uh, what I just uh, uh, mentioned, and um, 
you have you have some good news from good people in the business but the mainstream media is just giving a bad give it bad attention like from india i heard that india is banning cryptocurrencies or whatever blah blah and i was just doing some some research and i read that some indian people were just mentioning that they aren't correct the the the, the information that they are putting out they misunderstood it and i think the media is I, like I said in my previous video, I've seen this with cannabis, um, and with cannabis is actually a bit more easy to to spread the fud and stuff. But with this, people look at the numbers, people check at the companies, they look at the projects. Media can't go like this for long. Personally, I believe in this crypto st uh, stuff a lot. Like, let's go quick uh, to uh, Coin Market Tab to see the drama here. I believe in this a lot, but because I have seen this for days now i'm just like oh god man i i i, I just uh, got a new uh tv from my little bro shout out to you thanks for that and i'm just like yeah i'm i'm i'm, I'm a bit irritated that i have a busy week uh this upcoming week but i'm just like i really going to do some netflix going to play some games i'm going to spend a lot more time with my plans and do my thing you know uh, just to forget this a bit but when i when i when i um use my mind and think clearly i just know that this can't go through like this very long either we two things will happen i i can almost assure you of that and this is what i wanted to make this video i i don't have a lot of time to make a video because i'm getting a bit irritated because of all of these youtubers with their in my opinion not so informative videos and i just don't get the information what i want to hear so i'm going to say it myself uh, i have two scenarios for you we will go drop seriously um like to four or five k i don't think so but when that will happen i will be glad because i will be the first to catch the price when it goes to four or five k um, but I just think that doesn't that it won't happen because when you look at here, we went to the we went to uh, seven thousand um, we went to seven thousand for a short period here. If you look here, for a short period we went here to seven thousand seven hundred, but it bounced back really fast. You know, here I mean. In my opinion, this lets you show. I mean, here it went blah blah blah. It goes low, and here people, I must buy it. Uh, I I bought it for eight thousand, uh, so uh, eight thousand four or something. And I, uh, when this happened, I was at uh, at uh, doing an internship, so I couldn't log in and everything. I was busy, but I really want to buy at this point. And I think when we go to this point again, I I know I will. I will buy it directly uh, when it goes to 7,000 or whatever, you know? Um, so I t people are saying four or five. No, I definitely not think so. But there can be, uh, there can happen something that I, I won't even give an example because I would just don't know. I believe so much in the blockchain technology, but there can be, there can happen something like, uh, no, I don't want <laughs> I won't give an example, but there can happen something that people will, uh, even people that are um, know something, they will lose their trust. For example, when China banned cryptocurrencies, uh, I've heard that this person, Boxma, he, he said it himself. Uh, even he was wondering, for, huh? and I understand him. Should I continue with this Bitcoin? And he did what I would do, uh, I think. <coughs> Sorry. He sold a percentage of his, a small percentage of his Bitcoin, you know? So, um, yeah, I don't think it will drop a lot, but bad publicity can give cryptos a bad name. But uh, what I would really want to mention is that uh, the media uh, has been uh, putting out nonsense FUD for a long time. And the internet is really helping us. If we, if we wouldn't had internet before, uh, people would believe that stuff. They will talk with, with their ignorant friends and talk ignorant stuff and share ignorant information. Or, yeah, ignorance is not the right word, but false information, wrong info. 
and now we have internet so people media can spread the fud but a lot of people just don't believe it anymore same happened with cannabis you know uh, it took a while because people are so easily uh, indoctrinated I've seen a documentary about a magician that was fooling people and when another person uh, discovered this and uh, put this uh, uh, mentioned this to the people the people were like, yeah, no, you are the scam. Let that artist be the artist. This is a Netflix documentary, I forgot the name. But people will rather believe the fake um, uh, magician uh, than to believe that he did something wrong. People are scared to realize that the life that they have been living for a long time is, is, uh, is, is, is nonsense. So um, be aware of that. Things will happen. Uh, scenario one is that it will drop to 4 or 5k. I don't believe that. Scenario two is that it will be around this for uh, uh, um, a, while, a while now. And I see this because you can just see here. It looks like a very boring line. Here it, it went a bit down. But if you look at this, I mean it can get much boring than this. It drops a bit here because of all the fault, logical. But it is not very happy, uh, not a lot of uh, special things happening. So I think we will have this downtrend. Uh, let me do a good prediction. Or oh, not a good prediction, my personal prediction. I think we will have this for maybe a week, maximum of two weeks. And then we will see what we saw yesterday. Uh, green numbers. We saw a lot of green numbers. Maybe the percentages will be as high uh, as 100% or 80% but this will be you will see this a lot and when you see one day of green numbers don't put in all your money um, I'm very glad because yesterday when I saw the green numbers the day before yesterday when everything was in red then I did some buying but when you see one day of green a lot of people talk okay now it's over and I'm going to spend all my money on cryptos and then it drops some more so be aware buy in layers like i mentioned in the beginning of this video have a plan for yourself when it drops thousand i will buy some more when it drops two thousand i will buy some more just have a scenario uh, what you will do if, if 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 it goes down if it goes up if it, if it stays so the first scenario is that it will grow very low i don't think so the second scenario is that it will stay like this a bit and i think we'll we go a bit to that the third scenario is that we will go to the moon soon um my uh my opinion is will we have a scenario that will be a bit bouncing to the second and the third scenario i was giving i think we will have um uh, this for the coming time because people have just been indoctrinated by the fud but i mean lightning network some good news just have to pop out and uh, fear of missing out will pop uh, will, uh, you know that uh, the fear of missing out will come in with the people and we can rise like crazy again i mean remember this bull run that we had here it um, um, with with uh, with 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 a lot more people that know about cryptos at this po a moment. Um, we can have a bull run, and not we can we will have a bull if you if you do this on the long term. I can promise you we will have a bull run on the short term, or I think within a few months, that is comparable with this, or even a lot better, a lot higher. Um, remember, we are this market cap and a lot of people and even i when you look at the market cap of gold the fiat money and everything this is nothing we need to have a couple of trillion this year simple as that one to two trillion dollars minimal you know so keep uh, keep that in mind and yeah I, I don't know what the youtubers are doing um, a lot of people even that I like they make videos and then they just don't upload for a, for, for a whole week I mean are you serious I mean uh, we, we uh, as 
um, when you are subscribed, you, uh, you, you see a lot of good videos and uh, something's happening. You hope that some of these YouTubers will help you. The only one, uh, the only one that uh, these people here, to be honest, Crypto Love also, Data Dash not, but these people here just the crypto star wars give daily updates so you can just wait for his video to uh, to uh, to check uh, what he says and to compare your research with his to uh, to, uh, to 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 get some more young and investing also a good guy but my tips to all these youtubers man if you know uh, you you know a lot more about cryptocurrencies than me we need your opinion we need your uh, f uh, good videos to uh, to help us with this. Upload some more. Uh, I need it, uh, but since I don't have a video like that today from my favorite YouTubers, I just thought, fuck it, I'm going to make this video myself. Um, yeah, thank you for the support, everyone. Um, I really respect and appreciate that you're watching my videos. And let me know if you have any questions. You can reach me on uh, social media. And have a great day. Peace. Much love. Happy trading.